Big things are happening at Virgin Atlantic, and when I say big, I mean for the future of the aviation industry. Yes, on the 28th of November, 2023, pending, of course, regulatory approval and further testing, the world's first 100% sustainable aviation fuel flight across the Atlantic is scheduled to occur. The flight will be operated by a Boeing 787 and depart from London Heathrow before arriving into New York JFK. Overall, the news that Virgin Atlantic is closing in on flights, with sustainable aviation fuel being the 100% source, is pretty noteworthy for a project a long time in the making. And also, just very generally speaking for the broader aviation industry, working towards becoming more sustainable when jetting off. A feat that, yes, while Virgin Atlantic are closing in on, they're simply not the only company that is looking for something similar. Virgin Atlantic has announced that AirBP and Varent alongside the test are the two full leading suppliers, providing 60 tonnes of sustainable aviation fuel, or as you may see it more commonly written as SAFV very simply. In the lead-up to this flight, Virgin Atlantic saw a SAF blend of 12% aromatics and 88% HEFA, completing a very successful ground test with the all-important Rolls-Royce Trent 1000 engine, which, if you've stuck around the aviation industry for what is now quite a while and been keeping even track of maybe the videos here, you'll recall this is the engine that had those major problems in and around 2018 and 2019 that actually saw Virgin Atlantic 787s being parked up, and that feels like an eternity ago with everything that has happened since. But it's great news to see that the testing went positively, and had this, say, hypothetically not gone according to plan, while well, the full SAF flight that is scheduled now for the late part of November probably would have slipped maybe even into 2024. Virgin Atlantic aims to meet the mission of net zero by 2050, and the 100% SAF flight test is one of the many initiatives the company is looking at to become more sustainable. Whether it can meet the targets remains to be seen. There are, of course, people that believe it won't be possible, and there are some that are all for it, but one thing you can definitely assume is the company will be doing everything possible to hit the targets it sets out. It's very interesting to see this all unfold, as typically when airlines are making leaps and bounds in regards to new technology, new types of flights, they're doing so to be more competitive and maybe get an edge over other customers. But see, with sustainable aviation fuel, while Virgin Atlantic now are leading the way in terms of this Atlantic crossing, it's really a collective effort to make air travel more sustainable, and no doubt it's all about working together too. Any thoughts on this? Let me know down below in the comments. Will they make the November 28 deadline that they're saying and get the last required regulatory approval and testing completed? Let me know, or do you think it'll be pushed back potentially into early 2024? Thanks a lot for watching, take care and be safe, and I'll see you next time. And we'll fly.